Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of Beer Bros. I bet they didn't expect to see us again so soon. <laughs> this week, we talk about wheat beers. So for our first beer of the week, coming from... First beer of the week. First wheat of the week. Southern Star Brewery in Conroe, Texas, we have Garden State Hefeweizen. Garden State. Hefeweizen's being a... It's like New Jersey. Yes. But it's from Texas. Yes. Hmm. Interesting. And Hefeweizen's being a particular type of wheat beer characterized by their flavor, the particular yeast that's used. It gives it a banana note or two. So, um... Well, is there something special about this kit, dude? What the hell? Is there something special about this, uh... Can graphics. The artwork on this can was designed by a local artist, Nicole Gavin. It's the second art can series release. Garden State Hefeweizen features vibrant colors with a woman's face, birds, and flowers. It's a very busy can. It has places to go, people to see, things to do. You should be able to spot this can anywhere from any beer aisle, from anywhere in the beer aisle. Is that how you found it? I don't know. <laughs> It's been a long time. Let's take a look. It's kind of a darker wheat ale with a thin head, which is typical of wheat beers. Slightly effervescing, cloudy. Let's give it a smell. And you do get those banana notes, very strong banana notes. Mm hmm. A little clove, maybe? Mm hmm. Smells pretty good. Yeah. And this has a 5.25% ABV and no IBUs. It's not in, very cloudy. In a book I just read, they described Hefeweizen's as a children's drink in Germany. Uh oh. Huh. This is the beer that you give the kids when it's breakfast time. <laughs> That's the banana. <laughs> so let's go, go ahead and give it a try. Clinky drinky. Very clovey, very banana-y. Mm -hmm. Very smooth, which is also characteristic of a wheat beer. I'd say it's it's more clovey than banana-y. I wonder how long it's been since I bought this, and maybe that the banana-y sort of faded with age. No. <clears throat> I think with like the, the German halves, you tend mm -hmm. to get more of the banana, mm -hmm. but with the American ones, you get more of the maybe clove or other, uh, other ingredients that they use on it. Because I don't want Americans to know that it's really a kid's drink. <laughs> It's pretty good. Yeah. I quite enjoyed that. So then, with that, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're watching on YouTube, be sure to ring the bell. If you're watching on Facebook, be sure to share with all your friends. So until Wednesday, beer bros out. <laughs>